to make them small because then I think they bake better and they're not doughy in the middle. So I'm going to cut a bunch here and to me, to my mind, rolling the croissant is the trickiest part of the croissant. You want a very tight roll that won't unroll while baking because it's the rolls are part of the reason why it's flaky. And of course we're going for that crescent shape. Okay, I'm going to take the oddball one. So you take your, your ends here, your arms of the croissant, and sort of stretch it out a little bit. And then I roll down like that. And then I take the palm of my hand, and I hold this taut. You don't want this to break. I just hold it taut, and I sort of roll it up so I get a nice roll. And then the, the tail here should always be underneath, because if the tail's on top, It'll unroll in mm -hmm. baking, okay. so you always need the tail underneath. So that's kind of a small dainty one, but everyone take one and start.